Okay, so um, here is the tail. As you can see, it's, it's very, very beautiful. I mean, you know, plain but really, really pretty. I like it. And um, the thing that I did notice was this here. As you can see, there is a hole here. And you can actually see the monofin. There you go, you can see the monofin shining there, that's where it's um, ripped itself. And on the fluke, um, bits are coming apart here, as you can see that's not properly stuck together it looks like, or either it's been stuck in the box and folded and then ripped away. But um, this damage here is, is I think the one that I'm actually want to focus on. Because once it tears on this side, it'll continue right through where the monofin lies, and it's going to start ripping. So repairing that will be a bit of a problem because um, I don't really haven't haven't got a lot of idea on how it's going to. I'm going to do it, and future rips and tears. I mean, I bought some silicone stuff which I can stick on, but. Uh, It'll spoil what the tail actually looks like then. Um, obviously the colours were missing, but um, in all the tail is pretty nice and it was the main part of it was paying the £640 on top of the price of the £3,400 £3, that I actually paid for the tail. So I was expecting something a bit more glamorous, paying so much money for a full silicone tail. I mean, Finfolk do a really, really nice tail, and their prices were much cheaper. Um, but um, it's it's a nice tail, but it came with a few problems. Obviously, communication problems uh, during emails. Um, I, I was actually trying to get to Eric to say, uh, well, to say to Eric that I like the shape of the tail, but if it had my colours on it, the ones that I chose on my initial order, that would have been absolutely wonderful. But um, had I checked on the box that it was actually um, damaged by on that spot up there, and it seems like it's going to actually start ripping all the way through. And it was a bit folded in the box as well. And there is actually a dent on the box where the tail was laying. So it might be that the problem is, lies there where it's been damaged in transit. It was well packed, but I think UPS damaged the product itself, where especially that rip, because, I mean... It might look small, but you can see that it's completely opened up, and you can see the monofin under it. I mean, it's not even stuck to the monofin, whether it's supposed to be or not. But the monofin runs all the way down this way, so you can see the outline where it's tearing away from the monofin. Okay, well, that's a small video, but I will see if I can try and repair that. If I can't, then, well, I'm just going to have to hang with it. Thanks. Bye.